Hello, welcome. BC 2024 question 2B. A man shared an amount of money between his student Baba and William in the ratio 5 is to 6 is to 5. Baba received 1,200. We have to find the total amount shared. Then if William invested his share in an account at the rate of 20% simple interest per annum for two years, we have to find the total amount in his account at the end of the two years. So the first one, the first part can be calculated using two approach. I'll use one in this video. I've used the two approach in most of the videos I've done under ratio and proportion. You can check that in the playlist. So here we are going to say that the ratio or the sharing is between two people, which is Baba is to what? William. So that is what we are having. Sharing between Baba and William. So this Baba and William will move with the ratio, which will be 6 is to what? 5. So it means when the, the money is divided into a number of time, six portion is given to Baba, then five portion is what? Given to William. So how many parts is that money divided? That's the total part. So we can say that total ratio will be equal to six parts for Barbara, five parts for William, all give us what? 11 parts. So the money was divided into 11 parts. So 11 parts is what we are looking for in terms of money. By the six part has been given to us for Baba as 1,200. So we can use a simple ratio in this case. So I'll be using the ratio, but not the fraction aspect. So I'll be saying that uh, it implies that six as a ratio is corresponding. This is a corresponding to the amount we have, which is going to be 1,200. Then we can also have 11, let me bring it here, 11 as total ratio will also be corresponding to the total amount. So I'll be saying amount shared. So this is the simple ratio we can have. So you say that if 6 is giving you 1,200, then we expect 11 parts to give us more than that, right? So if 6 parts is giving you 1,600, then the 11 parts, which include the 5 parts, should be more in value than this. So if more, then the less among the ratios we divide, meaning 11 divided by 6 times the amount to be shared, the amount given to Barbara, right? So I'm sure 6 is a factor of 12. So 6 go here 2. That will be 200. 200 times uh, 11. So let's say that is going to give us 2 times 11 is what? 22. Then we add our two zeros. So that simply means that the amount shared the total amount shared is going to be 2,200. Do you get that? Good. So that is for the first part that we are asked to find. Then for the second part, we are going to look at how much is William receiving from this total amount. So I can say that from here, William's share of the money is going to be the amount that they are supposed to share, which is 2,200 minus the amount that the first person received. That's 1,200. So I believe there will be 1,000, right? 1,000 will be what will be left. So William will be having... 1,000 Ghana cities asked from the share. So 1,000 for William, 1,200 for Baba. 
All right, so this is what William is going to invest. We know under simple interest, what you're investing is your principal. Okay, this is what he is going to invest at an interest of 20%, the rate, at the rate of 20% for two years. So we can be able to find what will be the interest accrues on the 1,000. That will be added to the 1,000 to give us the total amount that will be in that account. I'm sure the analogy is clear. Good. So if that's out of the way, we can say that the principal, let's use P, is going to be the amount 1,000 that has been invested. What to be the rate is 20%, which is given here, the rate of 20%, simple interest per annum. What to be the time? The time is going to be two years. So let's find the interest accrues. We know the interest is going to be Principal times the time times the rate divided by a word, 100. This rate is given as this. Alright, so let's do substitution. 1000 times the time, 2 years, the rate, 20 divided by a word, 100. Don't forget, this zero, we we'll clear this. So we are left with 2 times 20, that will be 40. 40 times 10, that will be 400. So we'll be having interest I to be equals to 400 that I see. So that is going to be 400. So after the two years, the money which is 1000 Ghana City will accrue an interest or will attract an interest of 400. So that 400, what will it be? It will also be revert back into the account, to be added to the account, to give you the total amount that will be in that account. So we need to find that also. So we can say that amount equals to principal plus what? Interest. And the principal at the beginning was 1,000. Then we have 400. So... At the end of everything, there will be 1,400 CDs in the account. So, amount will be this. So, therefore, total amount will be equals to 1,400. All right. I believe you get the concept right from the beginning to this stage. Take your time and go through. Ask question if they need be. Don't forget to share, like, and comment. Very necessary. Bye.